it just to look a little bit. Great skill by Pagatar, though, just flicking it over his head, getting on the other side, but really got clattered. Just think the reference feel as if there's plenty of potential here at Crystal Palace. But James Warprouse works it very nicely. Now Kudus for the Hammers, and he's got a chance to work it out to Valau to continue. Pakatar has stayed down for West Ham. Going here this afternoon. Kudus squeeze. They've got a good retrieving of the ball. Proceedings. It was a poor ball. Probably wouldn't have got the ball to him. Let's go, sir. And they just. So check. Manages to step in in every Premier League game for Palace since coming to the club. Managed to score four goals, the only other time they did that. It's again sloppy by Antonio, but he's got away with it. And there's Kudus looking to drive West Ham forward. Emerson comes Richards contesting, but Zuma dominates and heads it away to the edge of the area. Kudus is running back towards his own. Zufal manages to nick it back off Mitchell, now Kudus. He's trying to make things happen for West Ham. He's got four pack for West Ham, and he'll look to set Kudus on his way here. Kudus into the penalty area. He's going to have a go issues with a couple of bodies in front of him. He's back on to Warprouse. Sufal into Kudus. Now Varez into Kudus, who wriggles between two challenges. Pitch here, he's done really well, Ben Johnson, he finds Mohamed Kudus. Chris Richards comes in with a brilliantly timed tackle to break. Deep lying midfielder for them. Mohamed Kudus, Kudus hasn't it, he's given West, just hasn't got into this game so far. Well, he's frustrated right now in this game, but he's been on the periphery of proceedings for much of it.